I hope you're having a pleasant evening. The words of legendary Hawaii broadcaster and musician Robert K. Kaula, who suddenly passed away this morning due to unknown causes. Before we go to break, here's a look back at his career and how he inspired many of us to do what we do. Robert K. Kaula's broadcasting career in Hawaii began in 1987, working at competing stations KHNL and KGMB, but mostly for KITV as their sports director and news anchor. There, he gained the love of Hawaii. There would never be another Robert Kikaula. He, he was so unique into the, you even look at when I was growing up, wanting to be a sportscaster, I had the luxury of turning on the news every night and there being a local boy, a, a Hawaiian on the desk that was just 100% Hawaii. And, and he didn't change the way he talked. He didn't change the way he acted. Those he took under his wing went on to great success, like Hawaii's Neil Everett, now a lead anchor for ESPN Sports Center. Everett telling us tonight, quote, Robert helped raise me, and for that I am forever grateful. I love that guy. Robert was the voice for University of Hawaii football for Spectrum Sports. When you're with Robert K. Kala, everything is brighter, everything is larger than life. The persona rubbed off on everybody, and you know, whether it was his Aloha shirt, his uh, his his voice, his uh, all of that stuff that represents Polynesia. His aloha attire and way of speaking, uniquely Robert. Perhaps more so than anybody else, he was unapologetically himself. Robert K. Kaula was one of the apparently most intimidating people that anyone in Hawaii knew, and yet he had the biggest heart was the best friend to so many people. But he was also a great musician. Releasing three albums as an artist and releasing hits under his record label, A Guava Ding Thing, like Mana'o Companies, Spread a Little Aloha. You could stereotype him as, as being just this big, you know, brada guy. Uh, but his artistry came from a place that was that was that had heart, that had sensitivity, that I think you could see in the way he delivered him, himself as a sports broadcaster and as a musician. You could tell he had a true, undeniable affection for this place and for its people. Oh, wow. 